What's up? Thank you for tuning in today. It's a beautiful day here in the outdoors, the jungle mountains of Vietnam. Got a nice waterfall next to us. Um, I'm here today to talk about the importance of spending time in nature. I have a watermelon, just so you know. Um, yeah, so the importance of spending time in nature and what better place to make this video than in nature. So I just want to make an analogy. You can think about the human body as like a vacuum. And so when we spend time in a city, in a city environment, an urban environment, with a lot of buildings, a lot of cars, a lot of people, um, our vacuum gets filled up with stuff. It gets filled up with pollution and toxins. So what do I mean by that? When you're spending time in an urban environment, you know, you're surrounding yourself generally with a lot of products, you know, if you're going into the supermarket or uh, the gym, wherever, hospital, they're using a lot of products, you know, a lot of cleaning products, a lot of things coming out of the air conditioning, and it's a lot of chemicals, right? So right there, you're taking in toxins. If you live in a place where there's a lot of cars, motorbikes, um, that's pollution that you're also taking into your body. Also, people. It's a huge one. It's what I would call energy pollution. So if you're, you know, living in an area that has a lot of people and you're interacting with a lot of people on a daily basis, whether that's from your work or whatever, like I said, go to the gym, go to the hospital, go to the supermarket, there's people around you and you're kind of taking in their energy if you're spending a lot of time with them. And you know, Different people got different things going on. People are stressed. People are angry, crazy, sad. Some people are happy, of course. Um, but there's a lot of different emotions and a lot of different energy. And that energy pollution from your friends, family, or strangers can really, can really affect you. It can really affect us. And that's a big one, taking in other people's energy. Um, so like I said, energy pollution, physical pollution from vehicles, from all kinds of products in the air, even in your own shower, you know, at least in the United States, they put fluoride and uh, pharmaceutical waste and a bunch of other shit in the tap water. So in your shower and your drinking water, it's even more chemicals. There's really just no way to win in the city you will always have some kind of pollution. And so when you come to nature, when you come to a place like this, I'm out here in the mountains, you know, I had to drive almost an hour outside of the city to come here. There's no wires around here. There's no civilization, no vehicles on this mountain, obviously. There's even no people. So this place is just very pure, it's the earth. It's, it's just pure earth. It's pure life, abundance, um, oxygen. Like, you just breathe in the air out here and you can feel the difference. It's so much more like open, clean, free. Like, when you swim in water like this, it cleanses your energy. The whole Different ele elements purify you in different ways. Water, fire, breathing, earth. But just the whole combination of just breathing the air, swimming in this water, having your feet, bare feet, walking on the rocks, walking on the grass. Um, all of these things work together to just basically hit the reset button. And all that pollution physical pollution, energy pollution that you have stored inside you from all the time that you've been, um, you know, in a city working. And like I said, when you come out here, it just, 
it's like flushing the toilet and all that pollution just goes out of you and you just get like a reset like changing the the air filter on a car or something or just yeah you're just cleaning yourself of all that pollution and whew, it just feels great it just feels great being out here like it's so calm there's no rush no hustle and bustle no you know there's no time out here it's just just pure nature and it's beautiful and you can come out here and just feel like so much more peace so much more balance connect with yourself take some time to just lie down and don't do anything meditate um just lay on a rock you know just swim in this water float in this water nature is it's so important because like i said it's just that that reset button and if you never if you're not coming out regularly like i am at least three times a week it's not always to a spectacular area that's so beautiful like this but at least you know i go to the forest or i find some r nearby river and i swim you know and i stay there for at least an hour or something three times a week minimum this is is my medicine i need it so like i was saying if you're not coming out to a place in nature regularly you're really missing out and what's happening is all that energy pollution all that physical pollution it's accumulating inside you and this is what's going to send you on a fast track to disease right this is meaning the body is not at ease it's disturbed so yeah all that all that pollution is going to accumulate and you're going to start you know that's when you're going to start seeing symptoms of sickness and it's going to be a lot easier for you to just get sick your immune system is going to get weaker when you have all that all those pollutants inside you so it's really really important like to take time to invest in yourself, invest in your health. Come out to a place in nature, whether that be a park near you, you know, the forest, the river, mountain, even if it's just your backyard, you know, whatever you can manage. If you can just get your bare feet on the ground, that's huge, you know, that's connecting with the earth, that's taking stress and energy. It's going out of your body, it's going through the palms of your feet, it's going into the earth, like, also, bathing in a natural water source is huge for purifying your energy. Even just making a fire in your backyard or in your fireplace at home and just spending time making that fire, looking at the fire. Fire is also very purifying. And breathing, you can just take time, you know, a really easy one is the Wim Hof breathing technique. It's like 11 minutes, three rounds. It's on YouTube for free. That is also very purifying. So all of these things, connecting with the elements, water, earth, fire, breath, it's huge. And um, I would say just, yeah, coming out to nature is the easiest way, you know, like nature just really does the work for you. All you got to do is walk or drive or whatever, come out here. And all you got to do is just be here. And nature will do all the purifying for you. And you'll just feel so much better, so much more calm, grounded, especially after swimming. That's huge. Like, I haven't swam yet, but I know after I swim in this water and I come out here, like, I will just instantly fall into, like, a meditation, like a meditative state. I will just feel so 10, 20, 30 times more peaceful, more grounded, swimming in a natural water source. For me, it's just, like, like smoking weed it's just but it's better because it just feels more raw feels more natural it just gets me so high so yeah that's pretty much all i wanted to say just the importance of spending time in nature um i know that some people have resistance to coming out here especially alone because people just oh we just live in such a stimulating world these days where it's just no i need to be on my phone i need to be checking my phone i need to be with other people i need to be eating something like I get it these are all addictions and coming out of the nature you know it's it's very confronting 
but it's also very healing. There's no one judging you out here. No one expecting anything of you out here. Like, you can just be free to be yourself. Scream if you want. <coughs> dance if you want. I like to dance. I like to sometimes come out here with a Bluetooth speaker and do a little dance. Sing some songs, you know. Or you can just get naked like I'm about to do after I make this video. There's no one out here and there's no one coming here. I feel totally free to get naked out here and swim and meditate and all these wonderful things. So, yeah. Spending more time in nature is something I really just started to do like the last couple of years. And really the last one or two years, I really started to realize how important it is for me and how it's basically medicine at this point. It's a necessity for this, for me at this point. So, um, yeah, get outside. You won't regret it. Um, yeah, and I'm just sending you love, loving energy, light, giving you a big hug from here. I love you. I appreciate you. Um, yeah. Get outside. I'm going to crack open this watermelon. Have myself a good old swim. And uh, yeah, if you like this, you know, give it a like, subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.